So we announced our training where we're not supposed to train very much. It seems like a lot of people showed up. And uh, today we are going to explore Dhaka for the very first time it seems. <laughs> So we are off and heading towards Uttara. It seems like it's a Team BDC reunion today. So somebody has to pay. Preferably the person who has missed the most rides. Therefore, candidates would be Tanvir, not this Tanvir, the other Tanvir and Muhammad, followed by Salman. Bame, Bame! Bame! So we have now left the roads and turned to off roading. We really don't know what these are supposed to be roads. So from here on out, we'll actually get back to some nice roads towards Uttara and have a good ride in the end. So That's what the early morning traffic looks like and it will only get worse as the day goes by. Hopefully the roads that we are going to take are going to give us a lot more pleasant tree. A lot more pleasant tree. So we are now crossing into the airport roads. It's a bit better but I'm not going to say it's one of the emptiest roads in Dhaka. That award still goes to Hakit. Apparently we are having a huge discussion about this tiny little flyover that we have. Some people seem to have fallen in love with their beds rather than the roads. We have been joined by the team from Uttara, Dhaka Northern Cyclist DNC. So they seem to be a lot serious about their training. Unfortunately, today will be none of that. We are inside Uttara now. Here on out, we'll be navigating through the back roads and getting to the borders of Dhaka. From there, we'll travel to Mirpur and breakfast and have breakfast at a place called bon Rabbani, which is the original reason that everybody came out. It's just magnificent today, slightly chilly, a bit of wind, but no sun and perfect weather for a bike ride but as we go towards the outskirts I think a bit of fog might show up but that's never a problem. This is Uttara sector 13. We are already nearing the very end of Uttara. The next parts that we go to that will be absolute outskirts. gentleman does not have what it used to have <laughs> so these are the DNC guys so on this side we have Sajjad Bhai and Porjito Hane Dose Trubo and uh, oh this guy this guy this guy used to come to us uh, train with us Mashik now he goes to work every day we have travel on the road and we have found one very confident guy Taking the road. The road was nice, he was checking it out. He was checking out the road. He thought that he would really get into it. This part, as you can see, no one lives here yet. 
I'm sure within the next three years, this will turn into the jungle that we have inside Dhaka as well, full of concrete and absolutely crap. And we lost another rider there. Another rider really, really wanted to see what the road was like. Honestly, it's quite enjoyable when we're not training for something. Then we have a chance to look at what's on the size of the road, enjoy the weather and not really bother about the pace of the group all the time. We'll do this more often from now on. This is the last part of the new Tura project and now we're getting out. We have had an accident on an empty piece of road and as is the rule, Drubo was involved. So our first victim of today's ride was Tarinda. The nice gentleman ran into a small crash and is now on his way home. Hopefully he will get there safely. We're really sorry that you had to go through this. I guess that's part of riding. First, we are on the absolute outskirts of Dhaka. As you can see, there is no housing. There are no constructions going on on that side as well. On the left side, there is only constructions going on. It is rather pleasant. And it is definitely, definitely worth it to come out here this morning. But at the same time, I would not want to do this every week. Probably once every two months is good enough. And finally, we are here for breakfast. And this is Rabbani Hotel and Restaurant. And very secured. Now, Mashvik will take you through the secured bike lock system. Alright, so uh, for a long time, we do talk about the bike security a lot in our pages and everywhere. <laughs> now, everyone talks about it, which is the best one, the absolutely best. It's made of gold? Uh, yeah, golden. So golden, you, no one can break it. See, I tried my craft, it's not good. Very secure. Extremely secure. Very nice. Very nice. So I really recommend it. <laughs> so after using our extremely secure bike lock system, we are now inside Rabbani Hotel. This is the third edition of Rabbani. And we are settling down for a very, very good breakfast after a very hard days of training. It was extremely tough, very very difficult, very long. The pace was immense, around 22 kilometers per hour. I know it's tough for you, but just keep it. <laughs> <laughs> so, we had our breakfast and now we are back on the road. Uh, we had some beef and some paratas and whatnot and whatnot. Now we are off towards Mirpur 10, from there on we'll probably head back home. So it has been a rather slow day, but it has been a fun day. Uh, we just explored a new bit of road which is uh, Mirpur 14. However, as you can see, traffic makes speed here an absolute impossibility. So that's it for today. Uh, we'll be back again next week in Hathi Jail training for the serious stuff.